afternoon, everyone. Welcome to the New York Times Hard Sudoku. This is Thursday, February 15th, 2024. And when I was inputting the grid into Sudoku Pad, I noticed the NYT was actually generous enough to give us five digits in a region. So uh, we'll see if that helps us. And let's go, shall we? So on my normal scanning techniques, I look for repeat digits in bands of three rows at a time. I see an 8 and 6, oh, and 1, and 2. I have a lot of help I can do. So 8 in rows 1 and 3, I can place an 8 in row 2 in one of two positions. 6 in rows 1 and 3 oh, actually places that 6 immediately. 1 can be put in two positions in row 1. 2 can be put in two positions in row 2. It can't go here because of this one. This 6 does not help me vertically, unfortunately. Okay, 6, 2, 1, 8. And I've got 9, 5. That's all I get there. On the top three rows. In the middle three rows, uh, 9, 6, 5, 2, 1, along with 3. So uh, those two 3s will place that 3 immediately. I think that's all I get. Yep. Okay, what about the bottom rows? I've got 9 and 7 that I can repeat. Those two 7s, we'll put a 7 in the bottom corners of row 9. And 9, ooh, actually, no, not, maybe it is placed. Maybe not. Oh, yes, it is. I have four 9s looking into box 7. This one and this one go down, leaving one of three spots. This 9 rules this out. That 9 rules this bottom corner out. Okay. Well, that was quite helpful. Now let's look by columns, shall we? I just placed my third 9. Uh, I have one 6, but I don't have two of them. I've got two 1s, so I can place a 1 in column 3. This one is ruled out by the 1 in row 4 looking to its left. Uh, I think that's all the columns I get. Looks it. These sixes are going to force a six in one of two spots in column five. Oh, and those two ones, actually, if I'd seen six, one, and one, six here, one also goes here. So this is a hidden one, six pair. Is one and six are in the same two cells in the same box. And their corner marks are only two the, of these. That'll give me four digits in column five, which I can use later. But five, two, and three are one digit apiece. That's all I get, along with nine. In the rightmost columns, those two six, uh, these two sixes actually place the six in column seven. Oh, I get two sixes for free today. Thank you, New York Times. These twos are going to force a two in one of two spots in column eight. And I think that's all I get now. I have six digits in box one. This three looks up, so these two are ruled out. Therefore, I can place the three in the box, which in turn will put one of two spots in as a three in column three. Uh, these two are four and seven, neither of which have anything looking into it from the row. But box one is complete at this point. That gives me five digits in column nine, uh, two, excuse me. One, three, four, seven, nine. I need two, five, six, and eight to finish the column. This sees five and six, it's only two and eight. This sees two, so it's five, six, and eight. Those two, unfortunately, are any of the digits. So that's not gonna help me much. I've got five digits in column one. 1, 2, 3, 7, 9. I need 4, 5, 6, and 8. This is anything. This is anything. This is anything. This is 4, 5, or 8 because it can't be 6. Let's see. 1, 9, 6, and 8, except 1 and 6 are already in here. Oofda. Okay, 1, 6, 8, 9 says I need 2, 3, 4, 5, 7.
for the rest of row two. Uh, that sees two and three. This sees two and seven. This is three, four, five. Those are just about anything. That's not two, that's not five, that's not three. Two, three, six, nine in column seven. I need one, four, five, seven, and eight. This sees one, five, and eight in its box. Okay, this sees just one and eight. Sees an eight, but uh, okay. Well, that puts a hidden eight. One of these two. That'll put an eight. One of those two. Okay, this is now a four-seven pair. So one, two, four, five, six, seven. I need three, eight, and nine. So these cells are a triple, and my first one in the grid. Not three, not eight, not nine. Okay, I can move the eight. I know it's in one of these. Okay, um, I don't have much else to go with there, do I? Two, three, six, eight. In row one, it says I need one, four, five, seven, nine. Well, neither of those can be one because it's in the box. I think this is any of them, yep. Let's see, that's not five or nine. Okay, that, ooh. Okay, that gives me a four, seven pair in the row. So this can't be four or seven. And these can't be four or seven. There's another triple. I'll go ahead and mark that one. Let's see. I've got nine in one of these two. Uh, three is in one of these two. That three in this virtual three in column nine will tell me a three goes somewhere in the central column of, of box nine. I don't get much else out of it, but I've got one, three, four, seven, nine in column two. I need two, five, six, and eight to fill out the rest of the column. Um, that's anything. That's also anything. Let's see, one, two, three, seven, nine. I need four, five, six, and eight for column one. Two thirds of a four five eight, but I've got six crossing a region. Mildly irritating. Three five six and nine in row five. I need one two four seven and eight for the rest of the row. That's not eight. That's not two or seven. So this appears to be one four or eight, and nothing else. Um. Wait a minute, okay. These nines are out, so nine in box five is in one of two spaces that are offset. One, two, three, five, six. I need four, seven, eight, and nine. The only thing I get is that. Well, I see an interesting thing already. These can't be two because of the pair. These aren't two by box. That's not two, and that's not two by given. This has to be a two. If I've placed a two in column five, now the only space for three is here. And actually, four, seven, eight, triple would have forced this two to this three. So three, uh, this can't be three. That's nine. This is eight, not three. Oh, look, four, five, seven, that's a triple. Not nine. 
Okay, this is 1, 5. And I've got a 1, 5 pair in the row, so I can place a 9. That's not 9, therefore this is it. This is. Oh, look at that. 4, 7, 8. Triple to fill out the rest. But 1, 5 pair says that's not 5, and that's not 5. Most importantly, 4, 7 pair forces this cell to be a 3 on the far right. Okay, 4, 7, these aren't 4, 7. Neither is that. I have a lot of triples interacting with each other. Is there's one. And here's one. Okay, what's left? One, three, six, eight, nine. I need two, four, five, and seven for column six. Clean that up a little bit. One, two, six, and nine. Oh, well. Okay, I put three in one of these. Three, four, five, seven, and eight. Those aren't seven. I wish I had another four, seven, eight here. I don't have much to go on there. All right, what does column three tell me? Five, six, eight, nine says I need one, two, three, four, and seven to fill out the column. This is two, four, and seven. It can't be one or three. This isn't two or three, so this is one, four, or seven. This isn't one or seven. Neither is that. Okay. Excuse me, okay, what's there? Three's down here. Okay, this is another two, three, six, nine. So I've got one, four, five, seven, eight interacting there, but this can't be eight. Fortunately, these are rather restricted. They can't be one or three by row, six by box. It's not eight, and this is two. It's seven and nine in the column, okay. Six is in one of these. We knew that. Okay, these two are not two, three, six, seven, nine. So they're from one, four, five, and eight. Two thirds of a four, five, eight, but nothing else to go with it. What are these? Not two, six, seven, or nine. By box logic, and none of them are eight. By column logic, that's not one. Well, let's see. This looks interesting. Those can't be nine. This can't be 9 by place. This can't be 9 by given. Yeah, where's the, where does 9 go in column 8? Right there. It can't go anywhere else. Now that's the only place for 2. So 8. Not 8. Uh, those aren't 8 either. This is a 2. Uh, let's go. Oh, 8 comes over here. This is 1 because it can't be 8. This is not 1 or 8. This is 4, which makes that 7 to fill out the row. Let's see, 1 and 4. So 
because this isn't one. This isn't one or four. That's not four, so now I've got a five. Oh, five, eight makes this seven. These aren't four. Okay, that's a one, five, eight triple down there. One comes up here. Five. Yeah. Wrong mode. That's five. That's one. Not one. Okay, this is a three, four, five triple. So this can't be five. This can't be five or eight, so that's a one. Six, one. No, oh, this is an eight because I just placed it. Six makes this five. So this now isn't 5 or 8, that's a 4. This is done with 2, 3 pair, which makes that 4. This is a 1. 4 comes up. That's 5, so 6, 2. Five, that's 6. This is 8. It's the only thing left that isn't 2, 3. Not 8. Okay, four comes over. These aren't four. Seven, eight makes this a four. Eight, five. And just like that, I think this puzzle has collapsed. Five in row eight tells me that sounds a four in column six. So three, five, four. That triple is done. These aren't four. Um... This three means this isn't three. Oh, and there's only one cell left in row eight. That's an eight. So seven, eight. Uh, this must be seven to complete column five. So this isn't four looking up. Seven looks over in the box. That's a five. That's a four. Seven, four. Seven, four. Two. This must be seven, that must be three, five, and then finally two and three, and just like that, 17 minutes, easy peasy. Yeah, normally they don't collapse quite that quickly, but I'll take it. Pretty much as soon as I filled out the top three rows, I was done. But thank you for joining me this afternoon.